I could say it until I'm blue in the face, but you won't believe it because you want to be that bad Hoovian negative. You don't know how to add. You don't realize that when Comic-Con comes along, there'll be nothing of Doctor Who to talk about if Doctor Who is canceled, and you'll still have to wait for the spinoff. And you can't put two and two together to get four. You think that they could cancel Doctor Who, but then still talk about the spinoff with no season of Doctor Who happening for a year. So you're thinking, okay, season two is done, it's filmed, Comic-Con comes, Doctor Who is canceled, and then you have no Doctor Who for a whole year, and then you have to wait for the, the, the war between the land and the sea. You don't understand. It doesn't work that way. There has to be a Doctor Who season before the spinoff. There's not going to be Disney Plus Doctor Who season one, season two, nothingness, and then the spinoff. It doesn't work that way. Russell got the money for Disney Plus. He's going to be filming with Shooty. The new season of Doctor Who, season three, they will talk about that at Comic-Con next year. You're not going to have the main show get canceled and then have a whole year without Doctor Who and then a spinoff. You're not adding things up correctly. You don't get it. You don't know how the entertainment industry works. You don't know how the shows work. You can't have the main show canceled if you're going to have a spinoff after. They have to have the show running and continuing into the spinoff. Do you understand? Do you understand? Why don't you understand? You have to have a season three of Doctor Who. And then you have the spinoff. They're going to film the spinoff in August. They're going to finish filming the spinoff in December. It's not going to air until a whole while after. So you have to have a season three before the spinoff. Shooty is going to film after his movie and after his play. He's going to film the third season of Doctor Who. It's done. It's The deal is made. It's paid for. They just can't say it's paid for. Do you understand now? Do you understand how it works? Do you understand how they can't go into Comic-Con next year where they cancel the show and then have the spinoff. The show is a success. Regardless of the tons of videos every single day. With tons of live streams and tons of up and coming Hootubers, YouTubers. They want to make a name for themselves but they're doing it wrong. They're making a name for themselves with the cancellation of Doctor Who lies. You can't listen to them. I'm the one that's going against it. And I may be the only one, but I'm the only one that is right. And you have to give it to me when the time comes. And no excuses on how, oh, this has happened this way. No, I've been telling you over and over and over again that there's a season three of Doctor Who. That Shooty is staying. That Doctor Who is okay with Disney+. Plus, But you don't want to listen. And you'll make comments every single day being annoying. And you're going to be doing that till next year. But it's going to be egg on your face. So you got to admit when the time comes that Matrix Lord 2 and 2 is victorious and correct and everyone is wrong. Take care. Bye for now.